All right, hey guys, what's going on? Welcome back to the Bratcat channel. This is Hobfoot, and we are playing some Horizon Forbidden West, getting ready to go into this crazy vault thing. And I'm just thinking, we need to, like, double check some of our stuff here. That needs to be removed. This needs to have that in it which means rocks how does the smoke keep getting by all means take your time okay smoke needs there Things get out of order, and I'm not quite sure how that happens. There we go. Oops. Yeah, okay. Time, Eloy. Open the door. Shut up, silence. Jeez. Yeah, we're standing outside this uh, thingy here. We're getting ready to go right in. See what we find. Oh, jeez, this stuff. Are you kidding me? I think we're in luck. In luck? The door is completely messed up. Obviously. But despite the malfunction, you can still get through. If you'll be patient for a while longer. Ah. See those crystals there? The Osram call them Fire Gleam. They're combustible. Not nearly powerful enough to blast through a door like that. But maybe just enough to jolt it open a bit more. Exactly. It will only work with an igniter. I'm sending you the schematics now. To build it. You'll need some machine parts and the oil from a kindleweed plant. That only grows underwater, but you should be able to find some in the nearby lake. The parts are more complicated. You'll need a spark coil from within a Leap Lasher's power cell. I think I got one. Remove the power cell before you kill the machine, or else it'll break. Got what? it. Looks like I already have everything I need for the igniter. Now I just need to build this thing. There's a workbench near oh, okay. the entrance to the facility. From your time tinkering with Hades? Tinkering? More like extracting invaluable data. He said about you'll have to get the leap lasher thing uh, before killing it. And I'm thinking, wait, 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 wait. I have to walk up while I'm fighting this thing and then like try and do... Uh, uh, salvage or uh, uh, get scraps from it and stuff like that. So, oh no, they just mean they gotta knock it off before it. Yeah, I'm I'm not the brightest tool in the shed. Special gear, an igniter. We got a little dangly thing off the end of our spear. Installed on the spear, this igniter can be used to detonate fire gleam and clear the air obstructions. Do I need to have the oil in my, uh, in my inventory every time I want to blow something up? Well, there you go. Should be able to use this to blow up that fire gleam now. Indeed. A useful combination. It's how I detached the processing orb from the horse in the first place. Great. I'm trying to think of that little circle on the end of the spear. There is it. And it's been added to it. It's not dangly, but what we could have been seeing with the wires from it going into the end of the thing. and So I don't, don't rightly know. But now we can finally get access to all those stupid places we couldn't get access to before. 
Ooh, big trigger pull. Finally. I think I'm in. Then by all means, proceed. Now that I have this igniter, I could blow up that fire gleam that I've seen before. Focus on the task at hand, Eloy. Silence, please fall in a hole and die somewhere. Thank you. Why is the thing saying out here? Letopolis? Okay. Oh. Eh. See, is this door malfunctioned or is the programming malfunctioned? Because if the programming's malfunctioned and this door can't be opened, then none of the other... Oh, this is, yeah, specifically a Hades facility. That's the Hades symbol. But if that... If it's specifically programmed malfunction, then we're not going to find a good copy of, a lot of water in here. Gaia, I'll imagine. There must be runoff from the peaks above. It may have been leaking in for some time. Last door. Stop it. Hmm. Bunch of screens in there. Letopolis again. Oh, love these triggers. Oh, things are gonna go swimmingly. This place is flooded. And there's another gene lock door on the other side. But that's where any Gaia backups would have been stored. I have to find a way to get over there. I like the idea of decoration for a hollow space, you know what I mean? Like those columns have ornamentation. And for basically no reason other than, you know, it dresses them up in some manner. Hmm. What are we going to find down there? Oh, I'm so excited. I love delving like this. Arrivals. February 1st, 2065. Travis Tate. The 5th of 65. Hernan de Leon. The 5th, Callie Hayden. Also the 5th, James Jong. The 6th, Haruki Sato. I'm trying to think if I remember any of those names. Hmm. James Jong, maybe Haruki. I don't know. Um, they might have been in the previous game. I'm just taking a wild guess there because I really can't remember. And then June fifteenth, Travis Tate, Elizabeth, and then sixteenth, uh, Hank Shaw, and then later security team Bravo. Was that the day everything? Uh, went to shit, or is there a problem with Hank or something else? 
I don't remember what the day was when... Oh, wow, they've got... Oh, come on, perfectly good weapons and masks right there. You saying we couldn't take... Saying those none of those were good enough to take there? I, think, I don't know what that thing on the wall is. Um... This is familiar. Picking my way through ancient crumbling ruins while you spy on me through my focus. Stop waxing nostalgic and concentrate on finding a backup. I wonder if I'm just not close enough. Oh, yeah, that can be. Yeah, I'm just not close enough. Okay. Caster might come in handy here. Okay. Are you traveling around on this thing? Guess not. Hmm. I'll find this in my stash later. Nothing in there. But it looks like there's some way. To perhaps get around to make it up there. Hmm. I think if this is the way I go up or I come down. Okay, what the heck was that? Okay, must have to jump around there later. Well, since we're in here, let's go ahead and explore some. This is a big old facility. I suppose it's probably a little too early for us to get the breathing apparatus. Big facility, but well, that's as far as we're going there. to get an acceptable level of exploration down in here to be certain we haven't missed or overlooked anything. Alright, 
I am 99% sure there is nothing in this place underwater. But, doesn't hurt. Oh, I guess I can't go that way. I don't like invisible walls in places where it's like, I should clearly be able to go this way. There's nothing stopping me. they need all this space for? That's what I want to know. Alright, I suppose we shall go back. From whence we came. Hits. Can't tell if that's really a thing I can grab onto over there or not. I suppose it is. Hmm. Nice. Wasn't sure if I'd managed to pull that off or not. There's a very good chance I was ending up back in the water. Pretty a good idea to drop that ladder. Drop what ladder? What are you talking about? Oh, this one? I totally knew that was there the whole time. Totally saw it. Totally saw it. Door's locked. But there's some kind of device next to it. Uh, another power cell, is that what we need? That's what it looks like. It looks like this connects to the door, but it needs power. Multi-purpose storage rack. There's an energy cell. Energy cell. These are much smaller, bigger than the ones from the first one. Is that it's a different type. Hmm. That's nice in there. I'm gonna stay out here though while I drink my tea, because I'll get jumped as soon as I go out there, most likely. Hmm. Here's the thing I want to test. Okay, it'll stay open. Interesting. And yeah, guess we need that, huh? What's about me? Yeah, I know I'm supposed to go look at that, but I'm not gonna do that yet.
Data point discovered. Nice. My man Ted, harbinger of the end of times. Ha! Huh. What can I do for you? Your modifications to Recluse Spider, the separate repositories for Gaia and Hades samples, well, the costs are off the charts. I'm gonna move testing of the Hades protocol to Zero Dawn headquarters next week. Slow down, Haas. Let me put it to you, nursery school simple. Baby Hades is a vile little thing. And it's gotta stay in its crib. One slip and it'll cut off every data stream and power line it licks. That's why this dark and scary hole you made is perfect. Very hard to get an unauthorized signal out, so all the cyber nukes you were working on here didn't fly the coop. You know, like Drax.net-4. I think your boys nicknamed that one the Moldova Brain Hack. That was a clearance level 9 project. Aw, oh, thought you goose scrubbed this place quickly clean. But your pal Trav went over it with a white glove and found the grime. No, here we'll be just fine for Hades. Later, teddy bear. If this place was isolated from the outside, then any Gaia backup stored here wouldn't have been purged. Safe from Ted Ferro's machinations to obliterate Gaia's Apollo database. Hmm. Which is probably why I wanted it moved, so we could probably do something I'm trying to think if Ted sounded different I hope they didn't get a new voice actor I hope they kept whoever it was originally oh okay don't jump then Not gonna budge from here. Keep pulling. Maybe I'm supposed to push it. I'll push it. I like how they're doing the music. Where it's like... The little melody sounds like it's coming from far away. Like it sounds like it's in a different... Room. Oh. Oh, four fell in. Well, how about that? What was this room for? Looks like there is another console that needs power. There's always more consoles in need of more power. All right, and we got our little box to do something eventually. Huh. That's a new hollow layout. Data console. Servers are still running. Shut down. Okay then. Maybe my focus can help here. Oh, whoops, didn't think it crashed. Ah, much quicker than pushing. Love these readouts around the cable. Seems like it'd be very practical. Okay, we're not getting through there. It's locked. 
so we are going that way. That is some violent stuff. What does the green stuff do? We're just carrying that around on us. How much worse is that? Okay. Okay. I thought as much. Oh, it's over there. So, like, what? Do what now? I think we went over this before. We can just drop with one of these, right? Oh, okay. Dropped it on our head. Alright, let's check this guy out first. He seems less critical. So I want to know what's going on. Whoa. Whoa. And Travis Tate. Look at all those screens. Oh, boy. I tell you, Liz, what I just done going to make you love me. Huh. I just imagine them far zenith rapscallions opening this fake guy we made for him. And I thought... What this really needs is a signature. This isn't a prank, Travis. I know, I know. All I did was just script a couple of avatars. A little you, a little me. To deliver our message of doom. Real personal-like. Would you just send it? As soon as it's done compiling, then you and me should celebrate. I brought party fixings, pizza rolls, absinthe, a couple of hacky sacks. Nah. I'm heading back to Bryce as soon as this is done. Color me confounded, Liz. Rice. Mm. How is it that someone like you, a paragon, damn near saint, you love this world so damn much, but no one in it? I mean, have you ever even had a friend? Go ahead. Compile complete. Data file, Baron Promise, ready for transmission. If you would, please. Logic bombs off. Here it comes, far as Z nuts. <laughs> Just keeping the best of what you do, Travis. Always admire you from afar, Liz. Where my mom was grave. And she was religious. Travis was wrong. Elizabeth was trying to make sure life had a future. She cared about everyone. I'm not so sure. The exceptional walk a path of solitude, Eloy. As you and I are well aware of. Yeah, you hear that? You need friends. You don't want to be like. Silence. I was the time I was just thinking in there. I was like, oh, like I know it's in the world and things are pretty desperate. Like, please never say that Sobek uh, slept with Tate because that'd just be too desperate. Like back in the day, probably with Pharaoh. Like I could see that back before, she, probably realizing how wrong everything was. Like, all right, that's fine. I mean, you know, you just need something, you know, on the side, just casual, like satisfy human nature. But yeah, no, Tate, mm-mm. No, not with Tate. Whoa, okay. Didn't realize that was a thing. What do we have here? Okay, well that was... A bunch of something. Is that door now open? No, it's still red. All right, still not getting through there. How am I supposed to get out of here? Did I miss something? Oh, wasn't I supposed to, like, jump up there or something?
Now we get up there. Hmm. time I want you to go ray into the far direction and you don't. Nope, wrong way. Nope. I have no idea how I'm supposed to get up there. I don't know how I'm supposed to get out of here. I feel like this door should have opened. Did I miss a... I miss an access point here somewhere? Okay, there's a whole area up there. Which I don't know how to get to. How am I supposed to get out of here? Okay, what am I missing? Gotta be missing something. Is it gliding? There's gotta be something I'm not thinking about. Ah, there we go. Bonk. Amazing Aylin hasn't crushed herself. There we go. Oh, what have we here? More rooms, vegetation. You can't get much light in this place. Surely these should be like weak plants and like glow a little bit. What am I doing? All right. Mail from Travis Tate to Zero Dawn H1 Betas group. Let's ride. My peeps, my betas, my four horsemen. This place is rad. Teddy F and his goon squad have it sealed up tighter than a nun's buns. Nary a fart can squeak in or out. Except through the testing line to Big M, and she's offline for now. Big M? Through the testing line to Big M? To Big... I don't know. As a card-carrying black hat, I'd never describe a place as 100% secure, but this joint is as close as it gets. We got Black Quartz Protocols. We got 6th Gen Naruki Signal Blockers. We got 14 miles of military-grade synth copper insulation. Our dirty little devil ain't getting out no how. So on to the testing. Procedures are laid out in the attachment, but here's the TLDR. Recluse Spider is designed for secure containment of two software modules, no matter how nasty. We'll have complete control over every point of contact, so there's no way the peanut butter will get in the chocolate without our say-so. 
For each cycle, we'll launch a takeover attempt, aka cage match. Gaia versus Hades. So Gaia can't get out and Hades can't get out. The two soft containments of two software nodules modules. Of course, it won't be a full sim, because we don't have all the goodies, so we'll have to launch Gaia's Matrix on a simulated SF grounding. I don't know what that means, but okay, they're testing them here. Got that. See, I want to be able to turn on the uh, flashlight. Because I can't see no very well. Does it even show up on the... Doesn't even show up very well on the stream. Hmm. No, I still can't get out. How can I still not get out? Where am I supposed to go? I thought, like, oh, I figured it out. I've gotten out. Oh, actually. Here we go. Just what I was thinking I needed. Okay, then. Really? Really now? There we go. Woo. I was like, uh-oh. If this doesn't work, I'm totally out of ideas. But this still doesn't get me out, though, does it? How am I supposed to get out of here? Well, I guess I should crawl back through the opening. Okay. I don't know if that's what I'm supposed to do or not, but that's the only way I can... What? What are you doing? See, I should have been able to come out on that ledge there. Drop a ladder. Use that ladder to climb up. And come across. But that door won't open. Pull that down, walk across. So I'm clearly meant to go this way. So why can't I? <laughs> Washed off some of the sweat. Why can't I go? the way I need to want to. Okay, I have got no idea. Is there another thing I'm supposed to do here? This power cell is pretty much down here at this point. I can't do anything about that. Ah, there we go. 
Uh, see, I thought that one conversation was optional. That's why. I'm, okay. I had them backwards. Because I thought we were going to get. I thought that console was going to get the big. Ta da thing. So. There's another panel up there that I should be able to pull open. I'll have to climb higher to reach it. All right. Whoa, 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 whoa. Yankadoodle. Don't think my pole caster can latch onto that from here. I'm gonna have to jump. Wouldn't be a horizon game, and you wouldn't be Aloy if you didn't. Whoa, that's scary. Hmm. I can't make that jump. But if I glide... I can just say I can glide, can I? I'm supposed to climb that? Mm, nope, just yellow spikes there. Not for climbing. That's for climbing. I don't think I'm going to get to the door from here. Nope, but I'm going to get the goods. There's a way to jump up there, but does that do anything? Oh! Okay. Forecaster won't work on that. Well, I guess I'm going all the way around again. Oh, okay, well, I thought I'd go farther. Up doodles. Up doodles. Okay, that's just scary each time. Never gets any less scary. There's more of the facility over there. I better take a look. Should be able to glide over. In. Problem is not being able to see very well. Okay, I got twelve berries. So you go to glide over, and you're like, is that another hole in the in the floor there? See about going up and getting over there.
Am I able to get through that door after doing all this? Oh, I can pry it open. Okay. Good, because I didn't think about that until I was up there. Too late by then. Oh, good. A storeroom. I can get just stuff. Is that what I got? Yay, I got stuff. Oh, this place is demolished. Okay, let's do this. Oh, 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 so close. Stupid ledge getting in the way. Why do we even have that ledge? Alright, let's do what we're obviously supposed to do. Donk. Run away! Cool people don't look at explosions. But I'm a freaking nerd and explosions are dope. What's in here? Ooh, all sorts of stuff. Uh, packs full, but my stash has room. And ammo that deals purge water damage is now available in your inventory. Use your focus to scan enemies and see if they are weak to purge water. Hitting them with purge water will build up to the drenched state. Once in this state, their elemental attacks are dispelled and they become more vulnerable to frost and shock attacks. Shoot purge water canisters, purge water arrows, detonate them, trigger large elemental explosion. I think this guy got a trap. Yep, and it's not going to be in the right place. Because why would it be? My focus might see something. There's data here. From Travis Tate. Bad urges, okay. Trav here. Dug up some old files from the Project Gossamer Thrall back before Hades moved in. Ted ain't nearly as thorough as he thinks. What his little doobies had going here, woo wee and using some naughty bits and pieces from the Ramses project at that. There's the Moldova brain hack, of course, but also up and coming little devils like the know-it-all memer or my favorite personal sovereign, or my favorite personal, my personal favorite sovereign seventy four eighty two. Now that's an apex predator. Assuming control of them, uh, Tidio. Tidio bots? Assuming control of them Tidio bots and arming them with household appliances? Imagine tidying up after that. Gotta admit, it'd be fun to see them hunt in the wild. Give them a taste of the good life before it's lights out. But no, nah, ain't gonna give in to temptation. Guess that's what I get for hanging around Lizzie. Maybe I just don't want to lose that sweet Elysium deal. This place turned out a lot of malware before Zero Dawn took over. Corporate malware at that. Balls, dude. How loud is it out there? Outside the noise dampening field? Next door. 150 it's decibels. Next well, I guess we got privacy. What's the hype, Trav? You and me go back a ways. But I never saw you cheat no one. Why start with Farzini? I was gonna tell you about it. They get a copy of Gaia. I get a spot on the Odyssey. Mm. But, but I told them, I said he'd so. two spots. Because I'm bringing my friend Trav. <laughs> Gosh, Hank. Sounds like the dampening field done slipped. You alright? No. I'm cool. 
like it got a personal field right here, see? Now, I know your ears ain't working so well just now. But see that text transcribing every word I say? Good. While I dial the music out there up to 170 decibels, how about you type in that transmit code? There you go. And that's all of it? Cool. Thank you, Hank. We're done. Security? Hank Shaw is ready for collection. No, uh. he's still breathing. Might want to bring a spatula, though. <laughs> All right, so that's how they got it there. So that's who Hank Shaw was. My focus sees, maybe. Any... Nope, nothing up there. Looks like this is connected to the door. It needs a code to open. Do I have a code? The only number I've got is that 7842 thing. Might be it. Well, let's try. Um, no, nothing. Audio, hologram, text. Doesn't say any of the ones are new. 7482. Okay. I don't know if that's going to be it or not, but we'll try. There we go. Hey. And, uh, yeah, before we go much further, I think we're going to call it here. Yep, I know. Blue balls and you're halfway through the exploration. But that's how it goes sometimes. So, we're going to end here. And uh, if you were super absorbed into this, then you'll come back for the next one, which is fine on me. And we will see what is just at the other end of this... Um... Uh, I don't know what this is. It's, an, it's a... A thing... It's a, I was going to say it's a prime, he want to say it's a prime site, but this probably isn't guy, it's not guy a prime. It's, um, it's just a vault, I guess. But they don't, they don't call them vaults. I got a name for them. I can't think of it right now, but yeah. So see the end of this vault. See whether we actually do get a copy of Gaia. I'm skeptical. To be QH. Um, yeah, that's it for me. Thanks so much for tuning in and, uh, peace out there, Girl Scouts. <laughs>